in today's video i'm going to show you how you can grow your trading account from this to this with my scalping strategy stay tuned to find out how it's not a game it's a red guys as you can see i'm on the gbp usd and um i'm on the one hour time frame so now this is scalping strategy so we will be actively dealing with the five minute like 15 minutes but first we need to check on the an hour time frame the one hour let's learn to know the market trend first before we can proceed with the trade or any other thing you understand we need to know the trends now um let us mark out the market trend you understand it's an uptrend so we need to we need our trend lines so that we can connect the dots together we can see i think we got i uh, broke this high from here we broke it here 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 so i think this is where the trend started we got an uptrend here and this is it i think it's like this guys this is it so this is what i want to show you guys as an example understand first of all you need to know where the market is tending to know it's an uptrend or a downtrend or a range of market so for this now you know guys when you are trading scalping i advise you well, especially for this strategy we only trade the trend we don't trade ranging markets you understand suitable you can trade the, the ranging market but you might find it hard to become profitable but if you trade the trending market oh your win rates could go up to 90 percent if you follow these rules you understand as how i'm explaining to you guys first go to the higher time frame check check um what trend is the market going what's the market structure saying here after i explained you how guys we knew this is an uptrend we can see these highs were broken these highs were broken these highs were broken which signify what an uptrend you understand like that like that like that that's how you know it's an uptrend or not yeah so up to take our entry and um spot opportunities we need to go to the five minutes we go to the five minutes guys um i'm on the five minute now so this is how the strategy work first we've known now we've known the, the trend of the market on a higher time frame we know that it's an uptrend so what are we going to seek for now we're really seeking for a buy understand on the market we are not going for sell trades understand throughout this trend because that's why i have the trend line that we use to guide us to know our paths so it's easier for us to become profitable and achieve our mission now before we enter a buy trade the moving average the 20 and the 50 which is the blue and the purple here must be above the yellow moving average the yellow moving average is the 200 moving average so the blue and the purple must cross themselves above and the yellow must be below so here here we got an entry and you, whenever you spot an entry you just go for your one to two that's one you are, you are going for a one to two risk reward don't be greedy don't be greedy guys don't be greedy here it's crossed it you enter when you when you spot the crossing then your stop loss will be where you find them um, the 200 moving average so that's where your stop loss will be then you go for a quick one to two quick one to two quick one to two that's it you have it guys we want the trade now let's look for more opportunities i think it's crossed it above here crossed it above here crossed it above here we enter our one to two again we enter our one to two again enter our one to two one to two so we can see under profit i think it crossed it here again we enter for our one to two again we have our one to two here then our stop loss will be below the moving average your stop loss could be below um the 200 moving average or below below the previous low or high you know that so here is, is the low so it could be below the moving average and 200 moving average or that last low or high I understand so that's it guys how that win again see so we have three wins in a row let's look for more opportunities so and one thing is this guys uh, let me give you a bonus to guys to be safe and achieve a 95 percent win rate you only enter when you see the crossing but the thing is this along the line there are still more opportunities just like we can see here there are still more opportunities we can see the market spiked up but you can still enter here but it's a bit risky but it's still profitable 
really start when i mean a bit risky this can reduce your win rate to like 90 percent or let's say five percent but it's still very profitable the way you can enter here is this you must make sure must make sure the moving averages which is the 20 and the 50 is still above the 200 you understand what i'm saying you must make sure it's still above the what the 200 then you will enter when the market come back to retest the a 50 moving average which is the purple one you understand so if it's a sell vice versa it must come back to retest the 50 moving average you understand you get what i'm saying guys that's it so enter along here okay now enter along here on the retest here for stop loss b on this we can put your stop loss here or the candle that created that low then we enter for a quick one to two for a quick one to two we want this trade i advise you to be on the safer side you can put your um, stop loss to be below the 200 moving average or this candle you understand but if we save put it below um, the 200 moving average because we want to win we want the secret of trading is to minimize your losses and maximize your win in the stands protect your capital first we want this straight let's look for opportunities let's look for opportunities and let's look for opportunities okay we've got one here I think the crossing okay but the crossing happened below crossing happened below crossing happened below now when the crossing happened below you can't enter that trade you can only enter when the market comes back to touch the purple the purple one signifies the 50 eme until when the market comes back to retest that zone that's when you can enter this trade here let me zoom in so you guys can see so this trade here you can't we can't find an entry here you can't enter because it doesn't make any sense you can't enter we only enter when there's a retest understand because you no know, discount and uh, premium premium price if you buy it high you you might run out of loss so we want to find a discount price so that's why we're waiting for a retest now and the retest must touch the 50 not the 20. you touched it here no no uh -huh. here you enter here you enter here you enter you enter here for a quick one to two to be on the safer side you stop loss here or your stop loss you can have a tight stop loss and uh take your one to two take your one to two simple if your stop loss was here too if your stop loss was here you got your one to two very easy you know see what i'm saying that's it like this is very very effective a very 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 effective very very effective you can see here you can see here it came back to touch it taking your trade so you can see here again so you can see here again and see a good one to two again guys this is very very effective very very effective guys this one of the best strategy i've ever created 95 percent win rate in the start it's very 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 good and it works on any pair but i advise you to use it on the gbp usd or euro usd you get that's based on my own um, experience but it works pretty well on every other pairs i think we can spot another opportunity here came to retest this this uh, the 50 moving average and the 22 stop loss our stop loss just be here the stance just safe we'll still we'll still we'll still we'll still make profits it's just safe you see take profit hit you guys we enter at this thing is just just to just to affect it guys we enter here our stop loss will be here you understand and uh, one to two so guys if this left to me I advise you to put your stop loss below the previous low that started that move for example here this is where your stop loss will be stand because if you can look at this zone the 50 move average acted as a resistance understand so your stop loss will, will be below that you notice know, most time that's why i told you you should buy when it comes to the 50 because most time the 50 moving average starts and um, represents a a resistance you get anytime it breaks that area just know maybe it gets the, the, the there's a significant change in the market and start most of the times you'll be right so that's it guys you can go on and on and take multiple examples you can see it crossed it but we can't enter because it crossed it they cross themselves you see they cross themselves below the 200 average no it's a no 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 
It's a no-no no for us. We can only enter here now when we see a retest. And where would that retest occur? The retest must touch the 50 EMA, not the 20. It's done. We can enter here. We can enter here. Yes, we had a retest here. Stop loss here. Then and to two. As you can see, we have taken our I think up to seven or maybe six trade and um, we haven't secured any loss we can see we are, we are doing it together yes, this is the latest chart i didn't like pick maybe the, um, the markets this is the latest gbp usd in the standard I'm recording this is the latest i'm recording this this uh this video on the 13th of july 2023 so this is the latest gbp usd chart we just we first went to the um, um one hour time frame then we spotted the trend then we are trading it this is just it guys so this is very effective this is very effective but when you before you put it to practice go home before you put it to a live account test it out they're more in stand because there's no how you you make mistake maybe spotting the um, the, the crossovers and something like that but just watch the video over and over and make sure you are perfect in it and always put it to practice so over time this video will, will do some wonders for you guys i can show you you follow the criteria as well so i think we have another opportunity here bounce stuff here so this is so sweet and interesting guys very very see people say I mean, indicators doesn't work indicators works but you can't just train the indicators blindly without understanding how indicators work now if you notice this this uh, this uh, this trade before we took this trade what did we first do we first know where the market was heading to we first understand what the market was doing we first understood the market structure so when we saw the market what did we see we found that we are in an uptrend and before you can be successful at this uh, at this strategy it must be a trending market so see that's an uptrend as a trending market so it's a good to go so that's when we can now apply the indicators and take those pullbacks in the stand and make us more profitable you, you can see that so that is how this thing works so i think we have another one here and uh and uh let's cross it here okay cross it here so you want to put our stop loss here or here no one but we always win profits we always win we always win we always win so you can see guys you can see guys that's it that's it guys i want you guys to give this video a like share this video and um subscribe you understand to support me so that i can keep creating more contents like these yeah so see you guys next time bye for now